What's good YouTube? We are back again with another video. In today's video, I want to give you a quick review on the Aaron Judge Authentic Jersey. Funny enough, I actually bought this jersey at the end of last season when he broke the record. So baseball season's back. It just started like literally a couple of days ago. And I figured I need to give you guys a review in case you guys are in the hunt for an Aaron Judge Authentic Jersey. Now, I was lucky enough to get 30% off. I think this retails for $2.99. So I got it for 209 plus whatever fan cash I had from Fanatics. So at the moment, I don't know if they're available on Fanatics, but go check that link down below. Hit it, put in Aaron Judge in the search, and then see if it pops up. And if it does, this is what you will be getting, all right? This is the Road Gray Authentic Nike Aaron Judge jersey. If you guys aren't familiar with Nike baseball jerseys, they're virtually carbon copies of Majestic. We have seen prototypes of what possibly may be coming out, but we haven't seen those baseball jerseys yet. So there are some jerseys with perforated numbers, a little bit of a different mesh. Again, we've only seen prototype versions of those, but we haven't seen them on the field yet. So if you guys are wondering, it's a very thin material. It's not like your old school polyester, but this reminds me of the Nike dry fit material that we would get the early 2000s basketball era, right? So that mesh material, the way it looks, the way it feels, very smooth to the touch. This reminds me of that era. There was a few teams that had the Nike dry fit, the Spurs, the Lakers. So a few of the teams that had the Nike license in the early 2000s for the NBA had this style of mesh. This is what you get here, right? Other than that, you have a New York coming across the chest. This is going to be single stitched in a really dark navy. Almost looks black. Stitched Nike logo. Again, <laughs> like just looking at it from here, a lot of the dark navy looks black. It isn't black, but it's as close as you can get to black as possible. As we get to the back of the jersey, we have your rubberized batter logo. Now, this will be one difference between an authentic and a replica. The replicas have a felt logo and the authentics have a rubberized logo. On the trim, you have your navy and white trim, but again, it's a very dark navy, right? You do have mesh paneling that is ventilated. So you have ventilated side panels here. Same thing on this side and then on the tail of the jersey as well. Right? That's another difference between this and the replica version is the ventilation and the long tail on the back. And also it's a much, much slimmer cut. I know I did a review on sizing on all the new baseball jerseys from Nike. So go check that out because it'll definitely give you more of a detailed look on how they fit, All right? And then you have your number 99 and this beautiful kiss cut. Stitching looks good. As we take a look at the jock tag, And then the tagging, we have size 48. Now, the Yankees, for some reason, are the only team that I've seen that have a made in Honduras jersey. So I have multiple authentics from Nike and baseball, and a lot of them are made in the U.S., but for whatever reason, the Yankees are made in Honduras. I really don't know why that's the case, but that is what it is. Also, my Derek Jeter Hall of Fame commemorative jerseys, same thing. Both made in Honduras. I have a St. Louis Cardinals. I have Toronto Blue Jays, and all of those are made in the USA. But Yankee jerseys, for some reason, are made in Honduras, right? So this is a size 48, right? I'm going to put this on for you really quickly so you can see how it looks on me. And again... I'm a different body type, different size and weight than most people, but I am 5'7", 230 pounds. So I will put this on so you guys can see how this looks. Hold on. So this is how the size 48 looks on me. 
you can see it has a slim tapered fit. If you think you're in between sizes, I would say absolutely go up. Number 99 looks good, but you can see how it tapers in. So, <laughs> you know, just be mindful. Um, these run very athletic. Uh, I think the jersey looks good. These are much nicer to wear in warmer weather. I remember wearing jerseys in the summertime, baseball jerseys in particular. And because of the thick polyester, man, it was tough to wear during certain months. So these are much nicer. Aaron Judge, phenomenal player. Also a Jordan brand athlete. We've seen Derek Jeter have his own Jordan 11, which is really cool. And he was a Jordan brand athlete for his whole career. So that's super dope. And now to see Aaron Judge, who is a home run machine. He broke the record last year. This is when I bought the jersey. I think on opening day, he had a home run as well. On that note, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be out. Peace.